Hello guys. Uh, welcome. I want to show you a secret that uh, no one showed me, but I'm glad to share with uh, my fellow youths because uh, farming is the backbone. Even if you pretend not to know. So this is my plot of land. Uh, I planted Napier. Uh -huh. I planted them in rows. Now what I'm going to do today, I'm going to apply biogas fertilizer. And I'm going to show you how I do it. I transport the biogas uh, through these containers. And I'm using my bite there. I'll take you through because the process from the place where I'm picking the biogas to here is quite a distance. I've already applied this line and I have a long way to go because I have to apply this whole field up to this end. This is the end. So welcome guys. Let me let me go ahead and start uh, my my duty. Let's go. These are the benefits of having biogas. This is one of them. Because uh, this, this sludge is direct. The, the plants will, will absorb them directly. That's my first line. My first line has consumed two containers of 40 liters. And I'll, I'll show you another video on the outcome after applying this fertilizer. This biogas sludge. So I came with my bike all the way from the other side. I just followed the farm. That's, a, that's another advantage of having a border here at home. Yeah, I carry them to here, to there. I'll show you how I do it. But now, uh, let's continue applying this fertilizer. It's quite hectic, but uh, for a man... You have to do what you have to do. Eh? A man has to do what he has to do. So I'm going to start the second line now. Let me start from the beginning here. There's no actual there's no actual measurement. I'm just applying according to to the amount uh, is coming down but uh, if i estimate it's roughly 500 ml per per shoot this is the advantage of planting the the nip and rose easy maintenance especially when you are when you are weeding because uh, if they if they are scattered it will take a, a lot of time and a lot of effort and also you will uproot some roots. But here, you just, uh, you just know where the, the plant is so you don't have to disturb the roots. And that is the least, that's the last bit. I'm halfway. So let me add some more. These ones, the plants will absorb them directly. Let me show you the last one. Then I'll take you through the, the journey. It's like four kilometers away. Because this is another farm. 
far from uh, our main farm. It's heavy work, but uh, I do it uh, consistently because I, just, I don't have to finish the work today. I'll do um, until when I'm exhausted. Then I'll continue tomorrow. That's another day. Here in the village, there's a lot of time. Instead of wasting it, I decide to be productive. At the end of the day, when the cows are milked, we are the beneficiaries.